climate crisis of gargantuan proportions that threatens not only our future but our current way of life. In city after city, rising income inequality is built off a social infrastructure reliant on fossil fuels. that 
while we have done everything in our power to make the Democratic Party work for us, the party has made it very clear it is not going to work for us. Some neocons are so disgusted with Trump's rejection of foreign policy establishment thinking that they declare the unbelievable. The neocons are going to fall. achievement, you know, a great personal experience, but I think for the working class as a whole, people adopted that struggle as their own in a way that I hadn't seen since I was a young socialist back in 1997 and the UPS went on strike and took down Big Brown in a way that shook America and gave people a slogan that they identified that part-time America doesn't work. And in our generation, for a lot of us, we've never been on a long strike, we've never been on a strike that presented the challenges that this one did. It was an educational experience, and for a small number of people, it was really a transformative experience. And I, I'm going to talk a little bit about that, because I think you can't put that genie back in the bottle. Even though we're back at work, even though Verizon is still Verizon, um, there is something under the surface that happened. Um, 